Welcome to the Latina Lowdown. I'm Cristina Ariola with Latina Magazine, here to give you your weekly dose of celebrity gossip. First up, we have a scary story for you, chicas. It involves Texas, brown people, and you guessed it, racism. The Daily Show correspondent Alma Regal took to the streets of Austin, Texas to find out what non-Latinos think of us. And well, it wasn't pretty. See what one woman said. Uh, if you look around, there's a lot of Hispanic people. I mean, not that there's any, I'm not racist or anything, but I think we're going to keep populating. We might have two kids. What do they have? Four or five kids? Yeah. Pro tip, if you start out any sentence with the line, I don't want to sound racist, but you're probably a racist. On to more positive news. The boss ladies of Fifth Harmony are miss moving on to their next single, Sledgehammer. Take a listen. Don't admit it. I play it cool. Thanks for the ear candy, ladies. That's definitely going to be our fall 2014 jam. In honor of Dia de los Muertos, we have a question for you. Do you believe in ghosts? Turns out, some of our favorite celebrities do, including Demi Lovato. As a child, she was haunted by the ghost of a little girl from the 1800s named Emily. Apparently, her mother would walk in and find her playing with this ghost from the past. And later, Demi admitted herself that she had seen the ghost in her own closet. Spooky stuff. For more really terrifying celebrity ghost stories, check out Latina.com's article, 10 Spooky Celebrity Ghost Stories. It'll definitely give you a haunt just in time for Dia de los I'm Cristina Ariola, signing off. Have a spooky Halloween, a happy Day of the Dead, and be sure to tune into Latina.com for more celebrity news.